Every year I come here and you drive down Magnolia Lane, I think everything else just kind of washes away. You just get to come here and play this golf course and enjoy the competition here. It's been a long journey to get to this point. A lot of sacrifices have been made, not only by myself, but by the people around me. I've been surrounded with great people for a number of years now, and I've always had a great support system, and those are the people that I lean on. Oh, Scott, you bring joy to the world. <laughs> the whole week was hard fought. The golf course was so challenging. I think I lost the lead maybe on number seven with a bogey. And then I had a nice stretch there, birdie eight, nine, and 10. Oh, yes. Come on now. That might be the shot of the tournament. Scheffler moves to nine under par and a two-shot lead. Certainly calmness about him. I think walking off of 12 green after making a really nice par, I had control of the tournament. It's an excellent three. But in order to keep that control, you have to continue to play good golf. And so I wasn't going to start playing too defensive and I was going to stick to our game plan. Tate and I did a good job of managing our way around the golf course all week. And so, you know, we had a little conversation there in 13 Fairway about continuing to play to our strengths. Second into the par five, it would lead to a two putt birdie. You know, I ended up going for a two from the rough on 13, which may have looked like an unusual strategy, but that was just more for us to continue to kind of push forward, knowing that pars weren't going to be good enough to win the tournament. He decided to set up another gimme with this approach at 14. We've seen that movie before. His stardom confirmed. There's just so much joy in those moments. I've worked my entire life, made a lot of sacrifices, not only myself, but the people around me have made tons of sacrifices in order to have just one moment like that. It's a true team effort out there, and I try not to look too far into the past or too far into the future. I try to live as, as much in the moment as I can, and so to be sitting here with the green jacket on, you know, it's, it's a lifelong achievement, and I'm, I'm just trying to soak it in.